I've also got inside the module here 50 real audio songs. So I can pull up a song here, press play. I can also adjust the tempo, speed it up or slow it down, mute out the drum part, and play along. I can also use Crip Record to put my own drum part to these uh, backing audio songs that are in the module as well. And another really cool thing, there's a USB uh, port on here which I can use a USB thumb drive and actually play along with audio files that are on the drives. That's a very cool feature. Drag audio files onto this uh, thumb drive with my computer and then play along with them as well. I can also use the USB drive to store my kits or to store any of my Crip Record files. So, pretty neat stuff. Check this out. I've also got the scope mode. So I press scope, I get a little click going on here, and when I'm playing along, the display is showing me if I'm ahead of the beat or behind the beat. So pretty cool that I can actually use this for practicing and see if I'm keeping time or not. Editing on the TD9 is really very easy. We've got dedicated buttons, a value dial, and a nice large LCD screen where I can edit my kits. So if I want to change the kit, I just uh, go into my editing mode here, hit the pad I want to change, call up a different sound. And if I want to edit that sound, just press edit, and I have icon-based editing here. Real easy to use and much easier to understand than like parameters and things like that. I can even edit my symbols, change the size, or even edit my ambience. I can actually put these kits in different sounding ambient rooms. Uh, I can put this kit, for example, into a cave. Change the size of the room. Change what the walls are made of. Got really nice editing, and again, it's really nice to do that with all these dedicated buttons and graphics on display. Uh, another really cool feature that we have here, all the pads are connected into the TD9 with a, a cable snake that's labeled, and it all connects with one connection back here, a multi-pin connector. It's pretty cool. If I want to expand, I can add a couple more pads with a couple of inputs on the side here. Uh, and also, if I want to play along with my iPod or some other audio source, I can plug those right into the mix-in jack. So, it's really really great features on here. The rack is also new, MDS-9 rack, lightweight but a four post design, really stable and I've got some cool new hardware here like a ball joint so I can easily adjust my snare where I want it to be, lock it in. Ball joints also for my cymbal arms and a little uh, boom arm here for my hi-hat so I can get things in position the way I want to. So, we're real excited about it. New VTOR series TD9SX and TD9S drum kits. We're rolling. Thanks gear guys.